Hey, welcome to the show. Today on the show, we have double digit, two double digit numbers. We're going to multiply them. You ready to join me? Yeah. Hey, if you want to try this on your own, try it on a piece of paper, hit that pause button. And when you're ready to check it with me, hit the play button. All right, let's go ahead and begin. First of all, when you're doing double digit numbers like this, you're multiplying it, you can just cover this number up so it's not too scary, all right? And we're just gonna work with the three. We're gonna do three times eight and then three times three. Three times eight, what is it? Yeah, you're right, 24. So I put the four right there and I carry the two all the way up there. We're gonna be adding that two. Now I can do three times three. Three times three is nine, don't forget, 10, 11, all right? So I put 11 right here. And when you're doing problems like this, try to keep those numbers straight. It just helps organize things so you don't get all kind of confused later on. Now I'm gonna work with this five. You can totally ignore that three right now. You put the hand over there, a little post-it note. I'm gonna take five times eight. I'm going like this, five times eight, and I'm gonna do five times three. So five times eight equals 40. So I put the zero right here. Make sure you put the zero right underneath that five. Don't put it over here, all right? Put it right there. So five times eight was 40, and I put the four up here. This plus two, that was in the past. If you want to, you can just cross it off. Um, sometimes you just learn how to just ignore it. Now we have a plus four. So go ahead and multiply five times three equals 15, and then 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So our answer right here would be 19. Now do you see how I wrote that nine very even with this number right here? That's really important. So now we're going to add these numbers here. So put the addition symbol, and now I just start adding. I start with the ones. Bring that four down. Four plus zero is four. All right, so I put the four right there, and then one plus zero is one. Nine plus one, 10. So I put the zero here, carry the one, and one and one is two. There's our answer there, 2014. That was a good year. Hey, hey, hey thanks a lot for watching the show today. Hey, take a look what's in back of me right there. We got a T-Rex right there. Do you see the T-Rex there? I love dinosaurs and that's why I created a new YouTube channel called Dino Math. If you take a look at that link right there, go ahead, click on that link. Come on, come on, I'm waiting for you. Click on the link. I go over there, check out some of the videos on there. I'm having such a great time with my son. We're making some math videos, Beyblade X's, everything related to dinosaurs. We're having so much fun. And I'd sure appreciate if you go over there and hit that subscribe button to that channel, also the, to the one right here. That really helps support our channel so that we can make more cool videos for you, just you. And I do read the comments and people will put in there, it's like, hey, can you do this problem for me? Sure, I'll do it. So, um, and I hope you're getting outside and doing a little playing out there. We'll talk to you later. Adios, goodbye.